This is a demonstration of the Pacha Camera Object Channel Box Unlocked tool. To load this tool, you hit the, either the sixth off button, which means six degrees of freedom, or you can go to the menu item here. So let's go back and see what this tool does. So we select the camera here, and we've got a lot of survey data here. So I try to move the camera, and then it snaps back. So the reason it snaps back is because we've got survey data. So let's take all this survey data, turn it off, and then we can see a new scenario. So now if I move the camera, the entire world is moved over. So what's happening is that the scene node is kind of animating so that the camera, the points, and the object tracks all stay locked together. And that's what this lock button means. So when, the reason for this is that uh, it keeps the match move from breaking. It's so that you could just move it into a different space or uh, level out the solve. But let's say you want to actually break the match move um, for the camera or the optic on a particular frame. Well, one thing, of course, you could do is use the nudge tool because this one always breaks the match move and will not try to counter animate with values in the scene node. But there's another way that can be useful sometimes, which is to use the six off button. Now, we know that if you hit unlocked, then you can uh, change the move uh, without affecting the C node and having a counter animation there, but you can't actually enter values into this box. So the purpose of this tool is that you can take the camera for a particular frame or an object and you can enter a different value in and it'll be unlocked, similar to if you hit this, but not exactly the same. So let me put another number in there. So the idea behind this tool is that you can break your animation uh, with a direct entering of values.